Hello, greetings. Uh, so sorry I'm wearing my headphones. If uh, some noise comes, disturb us. I apologize for that. Um, oh yeah, I forgot to say in my previous video, this distance mind control in Pakistan also, like don't go to the principal's house. God forbid. They said something really bad that they would kill her, a rel someone, her child, her grandson. Um, so, uh, you know, you might think that uh, recently, since I've said uh, on Facebook that Kashmiri Muslims are rapists, that this rape happened, or I might think because of me, because of what I said recently on Facebook. But this is a very long story. I don't know what the plan, I mean, I know the plan is to shatter me, put me in a coma. And Amber Dar, Dar came after I joined uh, Alban College. So um, it was very scary. They want to uh, cause a fear, panic, guilt, take us on a guilt trip, shatter us. This is what it is. I don't know why, but they want to scare us. And uh, why would, like I came here when I was living uh, with my brother, uh, Sheikh, uh, His Highness, late Sheikh Ahmad. I didn't even know Sheikh Ahmad, but I got the feeling like, you know, I've come to Dubai and this has happened. I came to Dubai before that, Sheikh Ahmed, us, Sheikh Maktoum passed away. Sheikh Maktoum uh, bin Rashid al Maktoum passed away. Sheikh Mohammed's brother in Dubai. I mean, of Dubai, but he was in Australia. And you know, they give these heart attacks and they jerked me and they're like pumping. You know, when you pump the heart, uh, what is it called? So uh, that kind of a jerk they had given me many times when I was in Karachi. And during my our Shia nights, Shabe Barat is uh, for Imam's birthday. Is it? Uh, also, Shabe Barat is practice. I mean, it's a commemorate celebrated by the Sunnis, but we have our Imam's birthday, 14th Shaban or 15th Shaban. So the air blue crash. And whenever I would recite Anoha, especially on Thursday, Friday, coincidentally, whether it was Thursday or Friday, I would recite Anoha, my condition due to my condition. Like, you know, principle, skin to skin. Like I sometimes couldn't touch myself. Uh, there would be a bomb blast in uh, the Shia uh, or a procession or some uh, Imam Barga or somewhere even far away from Karachi and the news would come to me somehow or in Iran oh no in Iraq uh, Sayyid Muhammad al Bakr uh, Hakim family also uh, so uh, then, uh, you know, in my dream, like the, I felt uh, the pain and the, but I said, uh, Salam, because uh, it wasn't going and I wasn't waking up. It was unbearable pain they were giving me during sleep. Then I woke up to find out and it was like, I said, Assalamu alaikum. Yeah, please accept my salutations, Imam Hussain, right? Shaheed at Karbala. Then waking up, I found out on the, uh, through the internet that they finally killed. I was telling Yusuf Zaidi that, oh, you know, the Hakim family has come and I hope he does something in Iraq. Sayyid Muhammad al-Bakr al-Hakim. So this is the way, and now it's Jana Mash Dami. Uh, they, did this to me on Facebook what uh, previously provoking me and so I would say these things against Kashmiri Punjabis again and then they brought the news 
they took me to the news now. Like forget Sunni and Shia uh, thing. Don't uh, let's go to India and worry about India now. So people would think that, you know, because I said this, now they're getting India because I'm Radharani and all this. And I would also think this and be shattered here like in coma, a semi-coma or completely shattered. How, how they tortured this uh, rapist who is now gone. And today is Janamash Dami. When do I find out? So it happened three days ago or two days ago. I don't want to even look at it right now. So I just want to say that uh, what did I do to them? What did I say to the Sunnis or those who were planning these bomb blasts when I was reciting Noah's and wasn't well myself? Okay, you know, uh, something like uh, Bibi Zainab and Bibi Sakina, uh, their, uh, the ropes, like I felt that uh, my uh, the rope they had kept me and my principal uh, with me, I felt and uh, like uh, so shy. So Sayyid Sajjad or Zulm Ki Zanjeer or another Noah and then there would be a bomb blast. And what a coincidence, Thursday, I would recite, so it's like distance mind control. What did I do to them? What did they, what did I say to them that was, uh, so they're making me feel guilty. They made me feel guilty in Karachi too, and very scared, um, you know, not having that confidence, courage, courage, because completely shattering the nerves. To distance mind control and we will burn you and this and counting I would hear voices counting from 10 to 1 or 20 to 1 and now they've got to India but uh, this uh, I've uh, realized that it uh, it's all over the world it continues uh, not only me, but uh, that they got uh, Jemima Goldsmith in uh, this. Thank God they did not get her, thank God. Like they've got me through distance mind control. So I would feel guilty coming to now, looking back. How can I take? They killed uh, all the sheikhs. Sheikh Ahmed. And uh, why Sheikh Ahmed? Just because I was in the bed. No. And so, oh, I put Subari in my mouth, sorry. And uh, this uh, Safdur younger brother. Oh, so did he become a sheikh or something? Well, that's what they're telling me. And he's got power. So can you imagine like if an Indian name here comments under the video, I will not be able to take it. I will delete your comments. I'm trying to find that feature where I can, because I don't trust you on Facebook or YouTube or any social media. Uh huh. They could, uh, they, uh, they, they could uh, take, um, buy a Hindu, get him to rape in India. So see, nearing Janamash Dami of Radharani. So they want me to be close down everything and isolate myself. And then they can, you know, through every energy, I'll be, okay, so it's uh, worse than death, suffocating me and throwing gins and uh, through gins, uh, controlling me. Yeah, so 
this is their plan actually not only because uh, i said something right now today recent i mean a few days ago against kashmiri kashmiri muslims that they are rapists and they have uh, done a lot it is through um, in in london um, uh, amber dar thing warned i mean was telling me that this is what they will be doing to you it's a cult it's through occult practices they get these things they disturb amber dar was very scared panic attacks unable to talk to me breathing problems coughing suffocation so i heard that on the phone in london about uh, nash having a cult be a uh, you know and being a cult leader i guess so it's um, they got me shattered when the air blue crash maharam safar where was that parachem parachem uh, no. place uh, sorry what's the uh, how par paraj what's that place where they killed the shia so much parachena Hmm. So I would feel guilty. I would feel fear. I would feel shattered. I would be in semi coma, unable to get up. This is a long planning of this. Oh please! I hope they they get caught. Uh, so. I have to do this. I have to come on social media. Uh, this is about my case. I cannot just sit there and do yoga and meditate. I will do that. I've been doing that too, but I cannot. Um, I have to come on social media, and the the plan is to completely shatter me, isolate me. and uh, kill me i uh, like uh, keep me alive and you know like suryala neither do you die nor are you alive no can you live uh, so uh, the ayat says in suryala of uh, so this is the planning for a long time in pakistan it was going on and on until i came to dubai then it uh, the shia killing stopped there imran khan won the elections ah uh, imran khan even got uh, this great prime minister he showed uh, that he has uh, taken a um, uh, imam zaman so he was tied an imam zaman through by was shan cha molana uh, alama shan cha hussain uh so he's been kindling uh like you know uh, unity amongst uh, shia muslims and sunni muslims in india i did see a video alama shah i'm just uh, searching shan cha hussain oh my god when will they stop so i have to do this until uh, whether someone gets them stops them now recently on a big day in dus rape case shanjana puri as in and uh, imran khan i think i saw a video on youtube that uh, He was tying. Oh, here it is. Great speech. Meeting Prime Minister of Pakistan. Yeah, this year. Sorry, the flash is on, and I cannot uh, put the flash off right now. I will have to upload this video. I, I sometimes I forget I'm not live like on Facebook. 
great speed. Uh, so Imran Khan. So you see, Imran Khan stopped, tried his best to stop the killing of Shia in Pakistan. But then the air blue crash, they tried to shatter me with that too. And their voices that my principal is being raped. And the assassination in October 1998, where my principal now, after retiring from St. Joseph's College, was that my fault? Uh, did I say anything? So they said it's MQM. And I was like, no, uh, later on here in Dubai, I found out, but I cannot tell you like I was, uh, like someone, what was I feeling? Like the principal is trapped somewhere, being raped. They were sending voices because since the uh, uh, Shia killing, uh, uh, was uh, it? I used to get up, but they found out that uh, by sh sending me rape, principal's vo how can principal's voice come to me? Like right now, the sheikh is decent. I was playing a game on now because on Facebook uh, they came and harassed me. So I was playing a game, like word game and other games like that, right? So they said, how can they send me Sheikh Muhammad bin Rashid al Maktoum's voice saying that, shall I beat her now? I was like shocked. So I stopped for a little while. And uh, so then, you know what happened? I went out and the taxi thing, they made me wait. And then the headache that uh, they gave me. Uh, so of course, I'm going to suspect the sheikh is behind this, right? It's causing all this uh, mistrust, suspicions, fear shattering coma kind condition panic strap uh, nervous breakdowns long time ago uh, since your uh, since assassination of uh, uh, Sayyid Hakim Sayyid another uh, where the principal he was from Pakistan whose school the principal was now a headmistress, Mrs. Munira Gulzar. They assassinated him. So thank God Mrs. Munira Gulzar had promised me that she would take me to the library and show me the library of uh, uh, Hamdard School. Uh, thank God she did not take me. They would have killed her too. I don't know what they would have done. So I was uh, like um, scared and principal's son uh, you know like I was wanting to tell them please when you travel don't be very careful who you get your tickets from which agency And even for my brothers and my father. Uh, so I was scared now because uh, they have a lot of, like, not, they have a lot of people. Uh, there's a whole lot of terrorist cult. And these are terrorists and. Uh, they're left, right, and center. Cults, uh, they're using jinns. Uh, they're using occult. Uh, they're using plane, hijacking. 
debts. Like we are just toys, you know, in Pakistan. Rapes. Rapes in Pakistan, Tariq Road. Increased. Uh, they were telling me some key. I mean, when I was in Karachi, uh, before coming to Dubai. So all this, uh, I don't know what else. So we need to find their leader, their master plan, the mastermind behind this. It's not uh, only is uh, the whether it's in Arab world, Pakistani, Punjabi, Kashmiri, Arabs mixed. So I have to go on until you find them and you put an end to this. Someone needs to, but this will go on.